Let me show you the simplest way for adding GIFs to your PowerPoint presentation. And you could add as many as you like on the same presentation. And then when you go to present by pressing slideshow on the bottom, you'll see all of them automatically start playing. And I'll show you the resource I use to get these GIFs and you could get a ton of others as well. So first I'm going to use this platform called Invato Elements and just search for GIFs over here and I'm going to press enter. And I'll just show you a bunch of the different options you have. If you come down here to graphics, this is basically the pack that I'm using for this video. But if you go ahead and click see more, you'll see all kinds of different GIF packages. I'll start with this one here. This has 10 different icons that you could choose from that are all animated. And what I want to do next is I want to go ahead and open up my PowerPoint presentation. And let me go ahead and add a GIF right here in this empty spot. So I'm going to go over here to the insert tab in PowerPoint. And under this drop down under pictures, I want to choose picture from file, not photo browser. Choose picture from file. I have this downloaded to my computer and I could go ahead and see any one of these, for example, and see which one is a good fit. I want the one that looks like a contract, which is this one. So the contract.gif. I'm going to press insert and now I could basically place it anywhere I want and I could go ahead and shrink it down. So if I grab this corner right over here, I could shrink this down and I'll bring it right over here and you can see it's already playing the animation. But once I go to present that slide again, I'm going to do that on the very bottom. Click slideshow and as you can see, it's playing the animation right on screen. And again, you could add as many as you like, like I have on this page for your presentation. There's a link in the description to Envato if you want to download your own GIFs instead of creating them. I hope you found this useful and I'll see you on the next video.